you and Dwayne, I think were like two people I definitely looked up to a lot when I'm trying to figure out the blueprint for my did ca say that. career that didn't exist. Um, Dwayne, especially my idol dudes in his own universe, my hero, like in his own universe, that the universe, he like, was doing it. And, and, and to the highest degree, I wanted to be like Dwayne. So eventually in the same way I met you today, one day I met Dwayne, he was just as cool in person as I thought he was on TV. He was, he's awesome. Made content together, went mega viral, 70 million views, 50 million views, linked up a couple times, um, visited him on set of ballers. Like I would have considered us acquaintances at least, you know? Kind of like uh, me and Dua Lipa. Kind of like you and Dua Lipa. <laughs> maybe, maybe even closer, dude. I would say closer. Closer. I would say closer. Um, we're just, we're just coworkers. He was just great. And then, um, um and then japan happened japan happened and you know i could go into so much depth about my remorse and the place that i was in and the faults that i made at that time in my life and i had to really rewire my brain and backtrack and ask myself like how i let that happen and what went wrong in my life where like i thought that was okay and in that process I did a lot of damage and it wasn't something that was on the forefront of my mind. And I've had to do a tremendous amount of therapy and figure out like what happened in my life that was so traumatic or didn't happen where I, again, that I did that. And um, DJ was one of the people I hurt because of his mother's um, experience. And that that's his experience to tell and I'm not gonna share it, but like I, 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 I hurt him so much so that, um, he he basically wanted nothing to do with me and rightfully so i knew i let myself down i knew i let my fans down i knew i let my family down but my idol too man it just stunk so bad and it wasn't like i got the call from him I got it from the publicist mm. and it's not like he did anything wrong it just like I think my ego told myself that I'm gonna fucking remember that. And if I ever become a great one day like you, I'm gonna remember this and I'm gonna remember the way I was discarded. And again, rightfully so. Um, but I, I don't think I've ever been really able to like truly let go of that. And uh, I, I got a lot of, stuff to work through i think in, in in terms of that and i'm not even sure like where to go from here 